It is Monday, 5.15, and time for your health beat. If you use eye drops, you want to listen up this morning. The CDC says recalled contaminated eye drops linked to bacteria have now led to a fourth death. This recall stretches all the way back to February. Patients and clinicians were told to stop using Ezracare or Delsum Pharma's artificial tear products. Some people have also experienced permanent eye loss with this. And after a doctor's visit, you might get a call about taking a survey. Now, whatever you say is factored into a hospital's patient satisfaction score. So as we all know, reviews are very important. It helps us decide where we might get the best care. Well, Sacramento's Mercy General Hospital has tripled its patient scores in recent years. And I talked to one nurse who had a big part in this improvement. Mercy General Hospital's Allison Cotterill is a third generation nurse. My mother and my grandmother were nurses, so I heard lots of wonderful patient care stories growing up. A lot of her time spent serving people with cancer. It really um, prepared me to take care of all different kinds of patients. Through promotions and furthering her education, she took on bigger projects. Nursing is all about the patient. That's why she started the Walk a Mile program to make sure they're getting the best care. That's where we as leaders and staff nurses actually sit down and try the patient food or take a ride on a gurney in the hospital to see what that ride is like to see if we can make it more comfortable. They even slept on the beds leading to new mattresses and a focus on a calmer environment. So when we first started, we were in the 30th percentile and last year we were recognized for being up in the 90th percentile for patient experience. She says it's about making sure all of the patient's needs are met. Really connecting with the patients, understanding what it's like for them emotionally, being in the hospital, it's a very scary time for patients and so anything we can do to empathize with them, put ourselves in that situation to understand what it's like, uh, really helps us take better care of them and create a warming, like loving type environment for them to thrive in. Because that's what nursing is all about. So I do want to explain just how in-depth this program is. The staff at Mercy General even sat on the bed pants. Cotterill says that might sound silly, but it actually led to a change in supplier. So the whole goal of this, experiencing things firsthand to truly understand the patient. Also, May is National Nurses Month, so if you see a nurse, thank one.